So what's up everybody? It's the green light special. What does that mean? This video is about Dollar Tree. I know, I know, they're not stocking you movies. But when I find you movies, it doesn't matter where, I'm letting you know about it. And I actually found a title that I would call maybe a quote-unquote grail, one that I wanted to find in stores instead of just having somebody look for me. And I finally found it. So let me show you the one box of new stock that I saw in this Dollar Tree and come back here at the end and I'll show you what grail title I'm talking about. Let's get into the video. Let's go. What in the holy hell happened to this door? So I tore down the whole front of the store. It's ridiculous. Yeah, I went in here and I actually saw three boxes that weren't here last time. It's a lot of old stock, but I figured I'd show you what they had. Blood Brothers, we've seen. Nut Job. Private War is not a bad movie. I recommend that. A Season of Orphan Black. A Season of Being Human. We've seen that on Blu-ray before. That Betty White set's pretty cool. It's a bunch of episodes of TV shows. A Date with an Angel. Life with Elizabeth. Rat Patrol. Four disc set. That's a good deal, even just for the case. And then we saw that BBC stuff. And then a season of 30 Rock. Season 3 is always the one I find. Has anybody found any other seasons other than that one? Uh, Phobias and Hunger. They're not bad. Got a Doctor Who, that's that Christmas episode. I found the 4K of that in Dollar Tree before. San Andreas with The Rock. What do you guys think of him coming back? It doesn't matter what you think! Um, Filth is pretty good. Son of the South we found with a slip. Assassination Nation, not bad. CD, what the hell? The Purge. There's another one of those. Season of Boardwalk Empire. That's pretty cool. Top Gear or from Black again. Some more Doctor Who. A season of Quantum Leap. Yeah, this shit's old, but damn. Um, it's good to find some new stuff that you hadn't seen before. Whoa, this is what I I've been looking for this. Awesome. That's just totally random. Can't believe I found that in here. That is amazing. These boxes were the ones I think here last time. Let's see. I'm so excited to have found something. Corporate Animals is good. So I don't know whether these bo where these boxes came from, but if it's a restock or shuffling from another store, but it's good to dig through and find something. Or change oh well I think I'm gonna get up out of this store hey uh, I want to do another one I was gonna do this as a short but they they had so many blu-rays in here I thought I'd show you I mean this is a lot of old stock but there's more rock of rampage um, Peter Pan I don't remember that one got stacks in here I, they didn't have anything in here last time I was here there's a double feature Look at this stack of Blu-rays here. I'll just let you see the spine so you can see what I'm finding in here. So, always check your store, man. Slight, some sharks. But let's get home and I'll show you if I picked any of this stuff up. So, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the Jeffman316 Pop Culture Reporter Channel. I'm your host, as always, Jeffman316. That's me on the sign. Come over on the weekends. We watch movies, we chat about it, usually 10 o'clock Eastern time on Sundays. And uh, yeah, join in on the live streams. If you don't want to do that, at least hit me up on Instagram, Jeffman316, and we can talk movies. Um, I'm going to probably show some uh, photos of some of the stuff I find if you, in case for people who are not watching all my videos. But yeah, what more could you expect to, to find in the Dollar Tree other than a Grail title, right? No, yeah, I know. I'm just joking. There's not been a drought 
and I know I'm posting this video and I'm going to get a lot of comments like, there's no new stock, and I know there's not. But somehow, my, a couple of my stores got some new boxes, whether they were in the back or whether I know a couple of the stores quit selling movies and they just maybe they dragged their ass over to the other store. But either way, I picked up four titles. I'm going to show you those. This I already had, but it, it's I don't see it very often. It's the four film shark collection. Um, it's got Shark Attack, Shark Attack 2, Shark Attack 3, Megalodon, and Shark Zone. Um, I mainly got that number one. I've got a bunch of shark movies that I'm going to put on eBay in a lot. And I wanted to include some Blu-rays in there because I don't have a lot of Blu-rays. I'm going to probably add this to it. I know I'm at least getting my buck and a quarter back. I'll make sure of that. The second movie that I got, I don't remember ever picking up. It was an, well, I didn't always get a lot of animated movies, but this is from Echo Bridge. It's Peter Pan. The Quest for the Never Book. Has anybody seen that? I figured I'd pick that up. I don't remember having it. If I did, I probably sold it in my yard sale. But Plus, it's a Blu-ray DVD case for a buck and a quarter. Have you seen how much those things sell for on Amazon? Go price what 20 or 25 pack of double Blu-ray cases cost nowadays. Um, the next one is a double feature DVD that I've got. And I don't remember picking this up either. It's uh, Val Kilmer. In both of them, Sharon Stone is in the second. And Curtis Fitty Cent Jackson is in the second one. It's Double Identity and Streets of Blood. I bet those are some winners there. Echo Bridge. But that's just a couple of rando titles. This is the kind of quote-unquote grail. That word is stretching it a bit. Um, yeah, I don't know if I want to call it grail when it has to do with this person. Um, it's about O.J. Simpson. Do you know what I'm talking about? Oh, come on, it's not that bad. It's this set right here from ESPN, the 30 on 30. It's OJ Made in America with that cool glove artwork. I know there's a single release of this just in a regular case, but this is the book version that I wanted. Um, yeah, $1.25 for this is pretty epic. And I've seen a lot of people finding it in the past, and I never did. So it opens like this. You didn't know you were getting an unboxing, did you? It's got one of the cool tabs that you pull up. And the reason I like this, it's a Blu-ray and a DVD set. So it actually opens like a book. And it's got O.J. Simpson's career stats in the front. And disc one is part one and two. And then it's got historic events of 1968. He won the Heisman Trophy on 12-5. And disc two has got parts three and four. The discs are in the book, in the pages. And then disc three is part five in the bonus. And it says the Bronco Chase route. I was watching TV when that shit was on there. You guys remember that? And the cool thing about it is it also has the Blu-ray. So the Blu-ray disc one has parts one, two, and three on it. And it says the Rockingham Evidence Map. And then the last Blu-ray has parts four and five in the bonus material. And then it's got a Johnny Cochran quotes and stuff. And then it ends with like it's a book. So that was one of the reasons I wanted that for a buck twenty-five all day and damn night. Um, as LA Knight would say, oh hell yeah. No, that's Stone Cold Steve Austin. He would say, just yeah. 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 So, yeah, O.J. Simpson Made in America. That's the title that I've been looking for. So, uh, hopefully you guys have found this if you want it. If not, keep checking your stores. Mine's putting out some stock. So, I actually got a title I was looking for. Yay! So, hey, hopefully you support me. If you do, thumbs up the video. Hit the like button, like, comment, subscribe, share. Do all the normal YouTube stuff. I love you guys. Keep supporting me, like I said, and I'll keep making great content. More movie hunts, more movie reviews. Anything pop culture related, that's what we do here. Watch alongs, like I said. Um, if you are a subscriber, make sure you hit the notification bell. I'll be doing more giveaways soon. We're on our way to 3,000 subscribers. I know I'll do one then. So uh, I guess that's it, boys and girls. And if you find anything in the Dollar Tree, put it in the comments down below and let me know. So until next time, boys and girls, this has been Jeffman316. I'm your pop culture reporter, and I'm signing out saying you guys be safe out there. Poontang your ass on out of here. No!